Hi guys, so today's video is a house tour. I thought it'd be fun to show you guys around our house since it has been about a year since we moved in and we've done so much to the house. I'll definitely be linking our empty house tour down below in case you didn't see it. But yeah, I'm just gonna show you guys around and show you what we've done to the place. Okay, so here is a view from our front yard. We have this white picket fence, which I love so much and I love our little yard. We have these super pretty, I think they're camellia trees and I love this one is light pink and that one is hot pink and they're just so pretty. And then of course we have our twinkly lights, which aren't on right now, but maybe I'll get a clip later so you guys can see those. This is our yard from this angle. We added a fire pit with some folding chairs. We have our super cute uh, little white table with folding chairs and like our little mandarins. Here's what the front looks like and our super cute Dutch door, which I love. And then, hi Frank. Frank is always here to greet everyone. But this is what the living room looks like. I feel like we've really made this place super cozy. And also this is like the prettiest time of day in here when this light's coming through. I think it's like five o'clock. Okay, no, you're not gonna do that. So stop growling, Frank. So here is what this little corner looks like. Honestly, it's probably my favorite corner in the whole house. I just absolutely love these built-ins. and this chair that we actually bought on next door from one of our neighbors and it's a pottery burn seagrass chair and we seriously scored on it i think we paid 30 dollars for it and it's like originally like 800 dollars, something like that crazy and all of our chinoiserie um accents and our record player back there and honestly, most of the stuff besides, actually some of the books too, but most of the stuff in our built-ins was thrifted, which I love. Yeah, but this area is so cozy and this is what it looks like out to our front yard. And then back to Frank and our couch with Frank's little nest he made. And this really cool coffee table that Kate's boyfriend got for us. And it's like all reclaimed wood. It's really cool. And then our fireplace that we filled up with these candles and they've burned down quite a bit. So there's a bunch of wax down there, but I kind of like the look of the wax um, all dripping all over there. This olive tree was from Hobby Lobby and I think it's so cute. And our love seat. And then this is what this half of the room looks like. Come over here. This was thrifted. I think I've gone through all of the furniture and stuff in another video, but here is what our living room looks like from this angle. It's so cozy, like I said earlier, and I absolutely love these beams on our ceiling as well. And then here's me in the mirror. This mirror we got from Target and I love it. This cabinet thing, I don't know where it's from. My mom actually had it for years and years and we um, took it from her house when she said we could have it. And then this little area is just where our little vacuum lives and we just have some blankets there right now. And our pretty lamp and then over here it's the door to the hallway just another corner and another cabinet we took from my mom and then here is our little kitchen it's very teeny tiny um we got frank's food and this is what it looks like when you walk into our kitchen obviously it's like our fridge, our stove, oven, microwave. It's such a small kitchen, so it's pretty self-explanatory. Um, we added in this little coffee area with our toaster oven, water filter. It's kind of just an area where our fruit lands and it's a nice area to have in this kitchen because we have like barely any counter space. And then we've added in this galvanized shelf from ikea and my sister's really good at styling shelves as you can tell so she made that all pretty and then up here we have another shelf which is really just all decorative stuff and it's super cute and then what else to show 
We have this open shelving up here and this might be an unpopular opinion, but I don't necessarily love open shelving. I feel like our um, dishes and bowls like get dusty, but it looks nice. And what else? Back right outside this door is where we like have our laundry, our washing machines and stuff. That is Southern California at its finest. Your laundry is literally in your like side yard. And then over here, we just have our back door and our cute little pegboard. This is where I hang up Franklin's leash. We have our little broom, um, dish towel, where we put our mail and then this super cute piece of art. And then down here, this is our recycling bin. And then that's where we put like dirty dish towels. So yeah, this is the kitchen, like I said. It's tiny, but it works for us and it's really cute. And I guess I'll get one more good shot of the living room from this angle. Cause it looks really good this time of day. Oh yeah, and then that's where I keep all of Frank's toys. We have this window, which is just really a fence and that's really it. And then also something I love so much about this house is the windows and how much um, fresh air we get through those big windows. All of our flowers and plants are doing pretty well right now. It is almost May, so everything's blooming. And then here is this area over here. We added this chandelier with these candlesticks and they are like remote controlled candlesticks with little lights. And then another folding table with folding chairs. All of our plants, um, these were all seeds that we planted a few months ago and they're just growing like crazy. I love this little cozy corner of our yard. And then we have like a potting shelf over here with just some empty pots, some bricks, um, just some extra gardening supplies. And then these are the doors that go into my sister's room. I'll get a shot again of this angle because it's so cute. I didn't get a good angle from the front, so let me show you guys that real quick. It's so bright and sunny out right now, but here it's at the front of our cute little house looks like. And we added all these flowers and plants and they're not doing so hot right now. The flowers were all blooming like a week ago, but they're kind of just dead now. That's pretty much it for our yard. Um, I guess I'll just go this way and show you guys Kate's room next. So here's Kate's bedroom. She has a nice big king bed, which I'm so jealous of. Um, and her room is also bigger than mine. This is what it looks like. And let me come from this angle so you can see a whole lot better. Here is her room from the hallway. We have these beam ceilings that are all throughout our house, which I love about this house. It is just a cute touch. And then she's got her full length mirror and this leather ottoman, which actually used to be in our living room, but I think it looks so nice in here and just adds a little cozy touch to her room. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, she stole my Dyson fan and it's in here and her nightstands and some photos, her dresser, and that's really it. Okay, so now from here, I guess I will go over to the bathroom. This is our hallway and we just have our steamer sitting there, but we have some extra blankets up there. And this is like where we keep our brooms and vacuums and whatnot. And here is our cute bathroom. And you probably saw my bathroom video where I applied this peel and stick wallpaper. So I will link that below as well so you can see the whole bathroom transformation and how I did that. The wallpaper is from Chasing Paper. They're a great company and it was actually pretty easy to install. But yeah, our bathroom is tiny. We just have this cute antique table, shower, sink, rug, me in the mirror, some cool antique art that we found, thrifting. And that is really much it for our bathroom. It's tiny. Now I will show you guys my room and I also did a bedroom video so you may have seen all of this already but I just wanted to do a complete house tour. So here is my room. It is very little um, and here is me. 
I have, I actually do have a little patio that goes out there, but it is gross and dirty. And I feel like there's just spiders out there. So I literally never open the door, but here is my bed. I absolutely love my bedding. Um, this blue linen striped quilt is from Parachute. My yellow duvet was from Ikea. This um, top sheet was a vintage top sheet and I don't know where it's from, but it's vintage and pink checkered. And then I just have my sheets from Target and then vintage pillowcases that I snagged from my mom's collection of vintage sheets and fabric. Um, I love the pop of the floor one behind the stripes and I love that the stripes go with these stripes. And then I have my art piece that I love so much that I found thrifting above my bed. It is gigantic and huge and I love it. I am sometimes scared that it's gonna fall on me while I'm sleeping. That has not happened and we have had an earthquake so I think it's up there for good. And then over here I have my little nightstand and I just keep like jewelry, perfume, and this is a plant stand, but I keep scrunchies in there. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it. And then I have my little duck that I hang my necklace on, my closet, and my dresser is in there too. So if you're like wondering where I keep my clothes, my dresser and all my hanging clothes are in there. And then I have this mirror I got from Target. It is from um, Joanna Gaines collection. It's like hearth and hearth and hand. <laughs> But I love this mirror and yeah that's pretty much it oh and Franklin's little doggy ramp because he has little legs and we don't want him to hurt himself trying to get up onto my bed and then my chandelier which I also found thrifting and then I also have my projector screen up there which pulls down and then I also have a projector but the projector light burnt out so I haven't used it in a while but that is pretty much it for my room. So I forgot to film an outro, so that explains the outfit change, but that is the end of our house video. I love watching house videos. I love empty house tours. I love house tours. I love all those types of videos. So I hope you guys like this one as much as I like watching those. And let me know in the comments what you wanna see coming up soon on my channel and I'll be sure to get back to you and that's it thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys next time bye